in this video we want to talk about removing from these standard uh, icons the icons I don't use so let's right click customize toolbar and from toolbar we have formatting toolbar here so the toolbar from uh, below and let's see what I don't use I don't use paragraph style because I'm using with styles not from here not manually I don't update from here and I don't create new styles from here. I don't use font name and font size from here. I use bold, italic, underline, but I don't use strike true. If I will need it, I will search for it in the menu. I use superscript and subscript, clear also, font color and character highlighting color. I'm using left center justify, but right not so much, but let's keep it, just in case. Unorder, order, and no list, let's keep it. Increase and decrease, no, I don't use it. Line spacing, I use it very much, but I don't use increase or decrease, so let's remove them. And I don't use left to right or right to left. You can see the toolbar is much smaller okay now let's go to the top toolbar so this is the standard toolbar this one so what i don't use i don't use new document from here because i, I use from menu but i use open and save from icons let's go uh, export directless pdf i use it I use print and I use print preview, but uh, there is a shortcut, Control shift o that I use often, but let's keep it. Cut, copy and paste, I use it, I'm using them. Clone, I'm using, undo and redo, I will keep them. Find or replace, it's Control h I remember the shortcut, I don't use it. Spelling, it's a shortcut, I don't want it. Formatting mask, I know how to enable, so I don't want that. I don't insert table from icons or image from icons, but chart, let's keep it. Text box, I don't work with text box so often, so let's uncheck. Page break, I insert from menus, not from icons. Field, I don't use. Symbol, I don't use. Hyperlink, let's keep it. Footnote, let's remove it, and not bookmark and cross reference. Comment, I don't want, it can be contextual. Track changes, I don't want. Shapes, no shape here. If I want shape, I activate draw um, icons. So, okay. So I have now what I use more often. What can I do now? Let's see. Let's change the icons first. Let's use Sukapura and everything small and what can we do more we can um, unlock from here so the position could be changed so let's move it this one here now I have a single line toolbar and I have more space for text but I can do more than that let's see let's write some text here and now let's see what we can do more. Let's try, let's imagine that we have to use this document. So let's test it. I want bullets here. Okay, it's okay. I want to save. I have icon. I want to open a new document. I have an icon, uh, an existing document. I want, can export, I can print, I can preview. You can see the shortcut, shift, control, O, what I am using every day. I can change the spacing very easy uh, I, let's insert some superscript and now let's insert some footnotes now it's a problem that I have to search for them so I think I will go to icons and I will add them because I was used to insert them from um, from the toolbar so let's add them again customize 
it's not uh, formatting it's in, not in the formatting but in the standard uh, toolbar so let's change so standard and let's find here footnote and note and bookmark okay so now it's much easier so everything I need is here what can I do more I can change the position of toolbars or I can move them on the left let's unlock this one also and let's move it on the left so now in LibreOffice I have on the left toolbar uh, I have text all over the page from top to bottom Okay, I have anything I need. We can test it. Some things here, some um, line height and so on, line spacing. And what we can do, we can create more space. How? We can remove this um, sidebar very easy with one click. So go here and close sidebar. So now I have more space here. This is what we can do in LibreOffice in order to have more space for text and less for icons. So now LibreOffice looks nice. It's your style, uh, your icons. It's what you need. If you need more icons, you can add them. If you need less, you can remove them. Thanks for watching and please subscribe for more videos. Thank you.